zombia, yore le woi, yore le zombia, yore le woi, yore le zombia, yore le woi, yore le zombia, yore le woi. Back again with another exciting video. Today, I want to start off by saying this. There's so much. I'm not going to curse today. I'm going to try to be good. There's so much junk which we absorb about Haitian voodoo in America. Today, I want to talk about loi, but loi in a facet that every wuga, boko that you meet, or mombo that you meet, they serve different loi. You know, they serve different loi. You know, you may go to this loi here, this this mombo here, and she may serve uh, Aida Wido, she may serve Maman Brigitte, you know, she may serve Maman Samzi, you know, but now you go to another mombo, she may serve Ezeli Mapignon, she may serve Maman Criminel, you know, so depending on where you go and who you deal with, that determines the loi that they work with. You know? Every, like, you have different fa like for me and my family, you have certain people that work with certain spirits. I had an uncle, he walked with Dumbala. That's what manifested to him. You know? I got cousins. You know, one of my cousins worked with Cousin. You know, that's what manifests with her strongly. Another one, she manifests Dumbala. Another one manifests Baon. You know what I'm saying? So, depending on who you meet, this is why you have method in voodoo. You know? So, this method here, this is the law that has a commonality with people. But now, when you have people that have a, a, a family of law that they're working with, the law that I work with is pretty much the law that have my, you know, uh, my aunts, my, my grandfather used, you know, before and people before him used. You know what I mean? So this is the law that we work with, with Swarby, you know? So this is the thing when it comes down to different people. These people that you meet, they have certain law that their family has been working with for generations. You know what I'm saying? So when people come to me sometimes, they ask me about, they ask me about tonight, someone asks me about Congo. I don't know Congo law like that. I don't work with Congo law like that, you know? That's not what we basically use. You know, my family, we work with Lada and we work with Pitwo. Now, of course, I've had my experimentations with other Lua that's not of, you know, uh, Pitwo or Lada. You know, of course. You know what I'm saying? But to say that I have a relationship with those Lua, no, I can't say that. You know? So, I want for you guys to be aware that when you're talking to people, you know, not, listen, People know in voodoo, you have a lot of people that are knowledgeable about loi that they work with. No wunga, mombo, or boko knows the mysteries of every loi. Like some people think that, you know, <laughs> you know, a person who's in the voodoo, they got to know every loi out there. No, that's not true. You know what I'm saying? There's like, there's so much loi, you will never be able to say, you know every uh, mystery of every loi. To do that is to uh, puff up your imagination. You know this is this is a this is a form of arrogance. You know when it comes to uh, knowledge, no one will ever know. There's too many. There's too many. So I don't have much more to say. I think my message is clear. So that said, thank you guys for watching. Like and subscribe.